Jason, Kata came in. He had the second most rebounds in the game. He had six offensive rebounds. That was the most for anyone on either side. What did you see in terms of his impact and just the energy that he brought? No, he was he was big for us tonight. Um, like you said, just the energy that he brought off the bench. Um, and I give a lot of credit to those guys, um, the Stay Ready group. Um, they worked they, they worked their butts off, and you know it's tough not knowing when your number's going to get called, but just having to be prepared uh, when it does. And tonight, um, he helped us win the game. You threw him a lob that he didn't see coming or something. It kind of went off the, the corner of the backboard there. I could see you kind of smiling. Like, what was that moment like it, it, when you you talk to him and, and try to, like, work on your chemistry, like, in the middle of the game? Like, how, how does that whole thing work? Yeah, I mean, it's a work in progress. That's, it's like the first time we've had that situation happen. Uh, uh, I mean, you know, just talked about it now. You know, we know next time if we're in that situation, uh, you know, be ready. You know, it's going, it's, it's coming. Um, when when you see Al Horford making the plays, we've talked about Al like a million times, and how much you love him. But like when you see him out there making the plays, like his hustle plays seem to change the game. Like mm-hmm. I don't know how many different ways we can ask you what you what you think of Al Horford, but like when you see him out there uh, making these plays, like what does it do for you guys? It it, it just gives us so much energy. Um, and we all we get so excited uh, when he does those things. You know, he ran from the opposite corner over three guys and got the offensive rebound and gave us another opportunity to score. Um, and you know, that's contagious. The the crowd feeds off of that. Um, we feed off of that. And you know, he's he's the guy on our team. He's everybody loves him and respects him. Um, and you know, night in and night out, he does things like that. Uh, that, you know, we can't say thank you enough for. Uh, Jason, uh, you talked a lot about you going to the post more this year, you and JB especially. Was that something that was talked about after last season, or did that come out of training camp after Drew and KP were brought in? Like, when did that thought process and the idea and the, to go to the post more come about? Yeah, I think, uh, you know, maybe through training camp, you know, the dynamic of our team, um, floor spacing and surrounding us with shooters uh, and just taking advantage of mismatches, you know, depending on who we're playing and, you know, who's guarding us and things like that. And how are you finding the balance of attacking in those spots? Because, I, I mean, a lot of the times you're sh- on a smaller opponent versus finding guys on the perimeter. Uh, I mean, you just, just read it. You know, sometimes they let me play one-on-one. I score a couple, then they just start doubling, and uh, you find an open man. Uh, Delano Banton got his first start for you guys tonight, um, and I was wondering what role you play in helping to prepare someone like him to play and what you thought about his opening performance. Uh, I mean, DB has been in his league for a little while. Um, He knows how to play the game at a high level, and he's part of that stay-ready group, right? Uh, You know, they come in every day. They get extra reps. They stay conditioned. um, They work work on their reads um, so that in times like this when guys are in and out of the lineup, um, you know, we can just plug certain guys in and, uh, you know, we can keep it rolling. And uh, he, he did well tonight. Um, he competed, made some big plays for us. And, uh, you know, I was happy to see him, you know, get an opportunity tonight. Real quick, what are your thoughts on the in season tournament so far? How do you think it's going? Do you like it? Is it something you're enjoying? Uh, I mean, yeah, it's cool. Um, I know that, um, you know, the fans enjoy it. the court. Um, the court is cool, you know, the different courts that um, each home team has. Uh, I know Tuesday is complicated. Yeah. There's a million different things that can happen. Uh, so that shit is a little tricky. But um, I think it's been I think it's been great, you know. Um, give guys something to look forward to. Um early in the season and uh, uh, yeah I guess we'll see what happens on Tuesday Dad do you feel like there's a little added incentive in that game uh, I mean yeah you want to win every game you play uh, the point differential thing I'm not the biggest fan of it because uh, you know there are certain instances I guess last Friday where the game was already over and guys still trying to score 
Uh, and, you know, it's all about respecting the game and respecting your opponents. Um, so, you know, that part I don't really – not a fan of because, uh, you know, if you was on the opposite end of that, you would feel some kind of way. So I understand. So, you know, just, you know, just try to win the game um, however you can. And then do you feel like you're all the way back coming off the illness and things like that? Uh, I mean, today was the first day I woke up and felt – uh, felt like I was getting getting back to myself. Uh, still a little congested, but I think I'm, you know, on the other side of you know feeling better. Thank you. <laughs>